is. Oh my god, it's been so long. Hello, welcome back. It is I. That was cringe, okay. It's been a long time since I did a video and obviously for that I'm sorry but we're just gonna pretend that I am like a good YouTuber and like good at life. That would be great because like just look at my nails. <laughs> Yeah. Today I have for you all a back to school supplies haul video because even though I dropped off the face of the earth and I literally haven't uploaded in forever, you guys still wanted to see this. You was all up in my DMs being like, can we see a back to school haul please? The one that I did last year, which I will plug somewhere, everywhere, um, you guys were commenting on that being like, can we see a back to school haul? So... I'm gonna show you what I've got there for the... Oh, well, I cannot speak. I'm gonna show you for... Wow. I'm going to show you what I got for the upcoming year. I'm going into year 11 and my options and exam boards will be in the description as they always are. If you're even remotely interested, they're there. So yeah, let's just get started. It's really self-explanatory. Okay, pens. I got these zebra pens. These are my favourite ones, but they last like five seconds. These are my all-time favourite pens. They are the Z-Grip Smooth pens. These are fab. I love how they feel when you write with them. They're just better than the other ones and all the other pens. I just like these. But they last literally 30 seconds. I must have bought about eight packs of these throughout the whole of last year. I don't know if it's because I write a lot, but these run out so quickly. But they're good, so I get them. I got a five pack of black. And then I got um, one of each colour because this will be good for like revision and titles and making things look cute. So I got some of those. And then stupidly I got these because I thought they were rollerball pens. Clearly can't read because it says on the packaging and on the back. But I don't know, maybe these will last longer than the other ones. I don't really know why they're any different. I think it's just because they're a triangular barrel. I don't know. We'll see. For pencils I got the Bic black HB pens, these look quite cool and you get a rubber with it and I don't know how many you get, oh you get eight in here so that should be fine. I then got a folding ruler, I then got some sharpies, this is a pack of 18 and for £10 I thought that was quite good. I then got some dry erase markers because basically how I like to stay organised and how I keep my life together is I have, oh I don't know where it's gone, Okay, that's great. I have basically a weekly whiteboard planner thing and it's A3 and I just pop it right here so I can literally just glance over or like glance up and see what I have that day, what's due in. It's really handy because it's so big so I can always kind of be reminded of what I've got to do. So I got some more whiteboard pens for that. I then got a packet of sticky notes but these are the ones which slot into your folder. Now I kind of regret not getting a couple more of these because I have more than two folders. Last year I got one and I put it in my biology folder and it's so helpful especially for doing like experiments and things as you can just write down like results and stuff on one of these rather than wasting paper and then write it up neatly. So yeah and it's also good to make like to-do list of things that you need to catch up on or that you want to go over. Um, but yeah I really like these so I might go and pick up some more for my other folders. I then got a prick stick. Now, Prit sticks are expensive, like £1.50 for some glue. Are you having me on? Prit stick, no, I ain't paying 50p for some crappy Asda's own glue which doesn't stick down. They know I'm going to spend the whole £1.50 on this glue. Like, I got a three pack last year and I don't know where any of them are, so that's great. I was watching back my back to school haul from last year and the year before just to like see what I bought um, and inevitably cringe. Um, and yeah, and I was watching it back and I don't, literally just from last year, I don't have any of the supplies left um, from last year. So I don't know where any of it's gone because it's not at my desk. So I must have lost everything. So yeah, got one of these. Now, this is my makeshift pencil case until I see one that I like. I need a clear one for exams, so I'll just use this one. Um, it was only 50p, so yeah, got this. Um, I couldn't see any that I liked or that were kind of like age appropriate which I wouldn't get made fun of for like Yeah, so I didn't get any and I just got this one and then when I find one I'll use that one. I then got some pocket pads because these are my favourite notebooks I think they were like three pounds each. Yeah, they're just notebooks. There's not really much to talk about really Yeah, <laughs> okay I then got these, no I didn't buy these yesterday, I got them in May in exam season but I'm probably going to repurchase them and you know get a lot more. I haven't really got much revision things this year, so I'm just going to get what I need when I need it. But, but I got these and I really like them so I thought I'd show them. This is just a flashcard holder and I've just got flashcards in here from, from my exams. Um, 
this this is probably like a sixth of all the flashcards that i need to make as this is literally just definitions for my exams that i needed to know they're not like general things um and then i got these which i love and prefer so this is full of literally two chapters of my business book and again that's just definitions so that's not like you know general flashcards like what are the advantages of a franchise or anything like that so i've got these spare for whenever i need them next as this is getting a little bit full i then got a folder and this is from slt slt i don't know how you say it um and all of my folders are from this brand it is amazing they're really durable leave arch files if you want a good quality folder get these so to go in there i just got a refill pad and then i can just make notes and rip it out and pop it in which is nice and easy i just have um all these plastic wallets and also i have uh subject dividers i've just popped them all in that folder so it's easier and i don't have everything like all around i then got some more plastic wallets these say punch pockets um which are just from asda you get 100 of them just pretty general really and then i've got some more subject dividers now these are plastic ones which well, i think they are let's see yeah these are plastic ones oh my god i think i'm gonna have to go back and get like loads more of these because i just hate the cardboard ones as I'm quite rough when I'm like looking through my folders when I'm trying to get to a place inside of it. So I think I'm gonna have to get lots more of these for all of my folders because I just prefer them. Like that's a bit cool, plastic. Great for the environment. And then lastly, I have my school bag. So, so I went to America for a couple of weeks over summer. I went to Orlando and did that whole thing with the Disney parks and stuff. It was really good. And one of the days we went to um, Orlando Premium International Outlets, because there's two, there's Vineland and International. Um, and we went to the International one. So I got this red backpack, which I really, really like. And it's from Calvin Klein. And this was supposed to be $188, but then they were having a 50% off deal. And then with tax included, it came to $101 precisely so this is my little backpack and i love it it's really cute it's a really nice material which seems like it will wash off nice and easily and not stain um i like everything about it if you'd like me to do a what's in my bag video then i will leave a poll and you can vote in that um but yeah it's just perfect perfect size i need a backpack for school i literally feel like i've got wonky shoulders now um that's like one of my insecurities so i'm not gonna point it out <laughs> i literally feel like i've got wonky shoulders now from carrying around a shoulder bag so I got a backpack so it's nice and easy to carry around with me and then that is everything hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you did then let me know by giving it a like and um, I'm gonna love you and leave you all here comment down below what year you guys are going into let's have a chat if you've got any other video recommendations then again just leave them in the comments don't forget to follow my social medias I'll have them on screen now and they're in the description um, but yeah, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more and I will see you then in my next video. Bye!